लिपस्टिक मत लगाओ अफेयर हो जाए जीन्स मत पहनो स्कैंडल हो जाएगा आई वॉन्ट टू आज दी अथॉरिटीज के ऐसा क्या हो जाएगा हमारी आजादी से आप इतना डरते क्यों है लिपस्टिक अंडर माई बुरका इज अ गुड अटेम्प्ट स्टार्ट अ कॉन्वर्सेशन अराउंड वुमेन सेक्शुअल फ्रीडम द फिल्म इज अ स्टोरी ऑफ फोर वुमेन living in the same building and dealing with shades of one crisis while the alankrita shivastava directorial has gained limelight due to its stiff with sense board the theme had created a lot of expectation but does lipstick under my burka live up to these expectations will the film manage to trigger a conversation about gender equality the story of lipstick under my burka has four different women fighting on a daily basis to live their lives on their own terms they do not have a say on any aspect of their lives from how they want to look to what they wear to even how should they speak in front of people they are well aware of their rights they also want change in their lives but it is far from easy parents expectations husbands irrational fears and self doubts are some of the things that keep them trapped lipstick under my burka is not just a content driven film but also a performance oriented one the presence of ratna pathak shah and konkana sen sharma already promised a good film the other two actresses ahana kumra and plabita bo thakur also came as a lovely surprise they are strong powerful women who justify their roles in every bit of the film with or without dialogues i still cannot get over this particular scene where shireen played by konkana decides to finally speak up for herself there are no dialogues Shireen bakes a cake for her husband and then eats it herself. It might sound simple when I try to describe that particular moment, but believe me, when Konkana eats that cake, the anger on her face, the anger that reflects years of being trapped in an unhappy marriage where you have no say at all, no say about when you want to have sex with your husband, no right over your own body, you're just a piece of meat. Your husband treats you like a pet. your own ambitions your desires your passion have no meaning for the so called husband i do understand that alankrita has tried to push the envelope but then asking our bollywood audience to think too much is actually too much coming to the part pehlaj nilani loves the most sex scenes honestly it is just too much of it and seems very fake while i salute the decision of the filmmaker to take up such a topic these sex scenes seem to have been inserted into the film just to create some noise however one scene uh, where a middle aged woman is sitting naked as part of her job to let artists sketch her is probably one of the finest best moments in the film what goes against lipstick under my burka is too much expectations it had promised a lot more than what it has delivered i am not saying it is a bad film but it does not have that lingering feeling once you step out of the theater uh, while you are watching you relate to a few scenes but the number of such scenes are really less for me the real hero of the film is ratna patak cha uh, who essays the role of bua ji an old woman who dares to talk about her sexual desires and fantasies and that's something uh, no other film has i think and that's something no other hindi film has been able to convey so far jana hai nahi jana hai um i know there has been a lot of hype around lipstick under my burka i also know that many critics have praised the film but let me stick my neck out and say lipstick under my burka has little or less entertainment value yes it is a good film yes it has some exceptional performances but it lacks quirk however only because there's a dire need to have experimental cinema and we need more films from female perspectives there's no way you should miss lipstick under my burka jana hai